You know, there's a lot of focus here by certain committee members related to just the fetal tissue portions of it as to the legality or is it for sale, a lot of that. But you know, one thing that is pretty clear, uh, if you look at the videos, you do see that uh, these little body parts represented what once was a living, human, living, feeling human child. And that when they came into Planned Parenthood, they were living, human, little children. And they died a brutal death while they were there. And we can't, av can't avoid that reality. With all of the, the subterfuge and the, the, the distortion and, the, and trying to do the bait and switch tactic, don't forget that these were once little babies that were killed at the hands of Planned Parenthood. Um, in the first video released by Center for Medical Progress, Mr. Bob, uh, Dr. Nico Nico uh, Nakatola, uh, Senior Director of Medical Services at Planned Parenthood, described the factor of intent as playing an important role in an abortionist's use of the abortion method. She said, quote, the federal abortion ban is a law, and laws are up to interpretation. So there are some people who interpret it as intent. So if I say on day one, I do not intend to do this, what ultimately happens doesn't matter. Because I didn't intend to, intend to do this on day one, so I'm complying with the law. So I ask you two questions. First of all, do you believe Dr. Nakatola's reliance on intent, as she described it, represents a valid legal approach, a legal approach? And secondly, what would change if we had the Pain Capable Unborn Child Protection uh, Act on the books here at the moment? Well, as to the, the I, think, I think she was referring to the issue of partial birth abortion, and it has been the, uh, uh, the, the dodge by the uh, pro-abortion side that uh, that y that law is only violated if you intend at the very beginning to have a li have a, a birth partially delivered of a live child and then killing the child and then completing the, the delivery that that is the process that you intended at the beginning uh, however the law doesn't work like that uh, you know uh, the intent applies to um, at each of those actions uh, that is uh, for, in, for instance, the intent to kill the child once the, ki the child is partially delivered, uh, not uh, whether this complete process was intended in the first instance. Uh, the, the secondly, the, uh, 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 the uh, Pain-Capable uh, Abortion Act that was passed by this uh, uh, House of Representatives, uh, th there, there is a, certainly a potential that some of the uh, children who are born intact and potentially alive uh, are, uh, you know, uh, produced at that uh, uh, period of time in which that act uh, would prevent that sort of, uh, of, ac of activity. Uh, a as a result, it could have an impact on uh, the uh, uh, obtaining fetal uh, tissue in those instances.